day of our lives. What did I just do? I littered. Litter, ladies and gentlemen, do you know a simple paper which I've just thrown on him? It takes six months to decompose. Did you know that the plastic bottle that we use right here takes about 30 to 40 years to decompose? Did you know that the covering, the plastic covering on these bottles takes longer than our lives? 450 years. What exactly are these things? Simply litter. Throughout history, people have been throwing this litter, unwanted waste, on the streets, in remote areas, in the countryside. All governments gave the least priority, and ours still does, to littering. And then, of course, we played for this negligence simply by all the diseases that have spread throughout the world. In the 14th century, the infamous Black Plague was a reason, was the reason why finally in the mid 18th century, governments decided to make a law against littering, preventing people from just throwing rubbish wherever they please. The seven main sources of liver are the litter, the refuse, the dirt, seven main sources, household, from the business community, from pedestrians, from motorists, from industrial wastes, from demolition and construction sites, and lastly, from all the uncovered vehicles that are traveling on roads every day. Why am I so strongly suggesting, please stop littering? Why do people always say, stop littering? Because, ladies and gentlemen, this litter, this refuse, this solid waste has so many, so many effects. Number one, the biggest one, the reason why us doctors are still in profession, this litter, this waste causes diseases. It causes havoc. You throw rubbish all over the ground. You throw rubbish in the empty streets. What does it attract? It attracts insects and pests. It increases their breeding ground. And we have diseases. Simply, all the open cans with water, stagnant water for years and years, causes breeding ground for mosquitoes and spreads a disease like malaria, which is so common in Karachi. And yet, gentlemen, it is the most easily controlled disease. But nobody cares. We still go about throwing rubbish everywhere. Did you know that decomposing of this litter actually increases the surrounding temperature due to ultraviolet radiation? And this increases global warming? Another way is simply that all of this dirt, rubbish, litter, it enters into our water streams. And what happens? Simply, you all know that our water main line and our sewage main line are actually running together. So any seepage causes dirty water. And dirty water means diarrhea, dysentery. What exactly is dysentery? It's blood and stool. Infection in your GIT tract. Waste always has a way of attracting people to add more waste. If I start throwing things on Yasir right now, and he sits there, it will attract all of you. Okay, oh, this dirty place, let's just throw it over here. Everybody's gonna do it. Nobody wants to break that cycle and stop. Another bad effect of waste, of this litter, is simply, it gets into our water line, and our seafood, our fishes, our shrimps, our prawns, they unfortunately mistaken this for food. So they eat it and then, and then all of this wildlife just dies. Or it harbors all this infection in its stomach and we're there sitting eating, mmm, fish, yum. Oh, prawns, yum. Oh my God, no, not yum anymore. I'm having diarrhea. Why? 
simply because we did not let we ended up littering we did not think uncovered vehicles did you know cost 10000 accidents every year 10000 accidents just because of these uncovered vehicles carrying loads so what is it that we do gentlemen simply stop littering use something as simple as a dustbin a dustbin is everywhere in recreational sites and parks don't just throw it wherever you are walk that extra mile it's just going to add to you being beautiful and looking thin secondly when you see, when at your household have two bags one empty all the fruit vegetable remains the putrefied food and use it as manure all gardeners will agree with me it is the best manure and it makes garden beautiful and greener what else can we do in our cars leave a paper bag in your car and just turn down your window to breathe in the fresh air which again in pakistan is not really true because littering and very simply the main thing that it does is litter makes beautiful place ugly so let us try for the betterment of ourselves and our future generations that we keep this earth which is our land our home whether it's one country or another we're all living on this world in this earth let us make this earth a beautiful place to live in